Hi everyone, this is Anne from Music Discoveries. In this video, we're going to be comparing the sound of my three small harps. So if that sounds interesting to you, stick around and we'll get started. So first of all, let me introduce the three harps that are on the list for comparison. We'll be starting with my smallest harp, which is just 19 strings. This harp is made by Waring, and believe it or not, it's made of cardboard. It comes from a kit. I made this maybe five or six years ago, and uh, it has no levers, but I've tuned it to G major, and I do that simply by tuning my two blue strings to F sharps. So this is ready to go in G major, 19 strings. It has very light tension, and also the string spacing is quite generous. I think the string spacing is pretty standard, actually, so this one is really comfortable to play. And light, it's so light, I bet it weighs about the same as a loaf of bread. Now, the next harp that we'll hear will be the one back here. This one is a Christina made by Triplet. This one is just 25 strings. You can also get a 26 string model. And it's made of walnut. Uh, it's fully levered and it has a beautiful soothing sound that is especially appropriate for harp therapy. Also a nice light tension, though not as light as the wearing harp. And then the third harp that you'll hear will be my Dusty Strings. This is a Dusty Strings FH26 double strung. And if you've been following my channel, you'll know that this harp is quite new to me. I just got this in March of 2020. And uh, so 26 uh, strings with two rows. And uh, also this one is fully levered. And the wood is uh, figured cherry. I think it's really beautiful. This one has um, uh, probably the highest tension of the three harps, though certainly a lower tension than my bigger dusty strings that you usually see me play. So I think this is going to be really exciting to hear the three harps back to back. And what I've decided to do is I'll play a piece. It's one that I just recently uh, released called Light of Morning. If you are interested in that sheet music, I'll put the link up in the cards and also in the description below so you can get it. There are two sections in this piece. There, there's an A section and a B section. So I've played the A section three times in a row, once with each harp, and then it goes on to the B section, which I'll play three times in a row, once on each harp. So I think you'll get a really good feeling for the how each harp sounds and looks when I play it. If you're interested in seeing the performance video of that piece, I'll also put that in the cards in the description. I've recorded that. I recorded it, I guess it was a few days ago, and that's on my bigger Dusty Strings 36. So you'll hear that nice, big, rich sound that the, the bigger Dusty Strings has. So I think we'll get started now. I hope you enjoy this and find it useful and interesting. Let's go.
I hope that was interesting and helpful for you. It was fun for me to play the three harps one after another. They each have their own personality and want to be played with a different kind of touch and style for sure. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or observations, which harp was your favorite? Maybe you own one of these harps and you'd like to tell us about it? let us know in the comments. And if you're new to the channel, you might consider subscribing so that you see more of my content. And please don't forget to give the video a like if this was helpful and interesting to you. So thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.